The first season of Gen V has already turned its actors into stars. Then you get kind of famous and all of a sudden you're number one. And we want to know more about them. Who asked for cleaning advice from the boys' veteran? Points for us, 100%. Why is Patrick Schwarzenegger proud of his long-term girlfriend? And are Derek Liu and London Thor related in real life? I like it. Jazz Sinclair as Marie. What the actress loves about the show is the way it humanizes everyone, whether they make good or bad choices. And it's also cool how it shows the way characters turn into heroes. I think Marie ultimately, you know, she has moments where she has to decide, do I want to look like a hero or do I want to be a hero? 29-year-old Jazz is great at portraying her complex character. Well, after all, it's not her first acting job. Before Gen V, the actress became known for her role in the Netflix series, Chilling Adventures of Sabrina. It didn't only bring her success, it also helped her meet her ex-boyfriend. Jazz dated her on-screen partner Ross Lynch for nearly five years. The two of them were always pretty private about their relationship, so we never knew much about it. But since the beginning of this year, Jazz and Ross haven't been spotted together or posted any photos of each other. So it appears that they broke up. Whatever happened, we wish happiness to both of them. And we're moving on to Marie's best friend, Lizzie Broadway as Emma. Although she loved working on the series, the actress soon ran into a challenge. She had no idea how to get clean after filming a huge bloodbath fight. And do you know who helped Lizzie figure it out? It was the boys actor, Jack Quaid. I asked him, I was like, how do you get the blood off? He's like, shaving cream and Dawn soap will be your best friend. Needless to say, the advice totally worked. And as for us, let's just hope that we'll never have to test this for ourselves. Anyway, let's proceed with Lizzie's personal life. She's 25 now. And about two years ago, she was spotted on a romantic getaway in Italy, along with the Cobra Kai actor Tanner Buchanan. They were kissing and looked pretty cute. Fans then found out that Lizzie and Tanner have known each other since they were kids. They went to the same school and were close friends until it blossomed into something bigger. The couple allegedly dated when they were teens, but things didn't work out. However, a few years later, Lizzie and Tanner decided to give their relationship another chance. Unfortunately, both actors keep their dating lives private, so we don't know if they're still together, yet we can tell you more about the next actor. Patrick Schwarzenegger as Luke. Although he dies early in the series, the character remains pretty important to the story, so we definitely can't skip him, especially since the actor behind Luke adores the show. See how he reviewed Gen V's first episode. This week's episode is, uh, it's fire. Well, the same can be said about them all, don't you think? And who could have played the golden boy but the son of Arnie himself? Especially since Schwarzenegger Sr. can also turn into a bad soup. Here's the story that proves it. When Patrick was nine, he once failed to make his bed properly. So his dad threw his mattress out of a second story window. Guess this is another family that deserves a reality show, right? These days, Patrick is 30 and is pretty happy in his personal life. He's been dating model Abby Champion since 2015. They often appear on red carpet events together and show some sweet PDA. Patrick actually can't stop gushing over his girlfriend. Among other things, he admires her bravery as she moved from Alabama to California to pursue a modeling career. Plus, he often posts their photos on Instagram and shares with the world how much he loves her. And what about Patrick's on-screen girlfriend, Maddie Phillips as Kate? If there's a cast member of Gen V who is the happiest to be there, it's definitely this gal. She's a huge fan of the original series. The actress recommends it to everyone she meets. You should watch The Boys, for sure. It's like my favorite show. And when it comes to the spinoff, it looks like Maddie loves it just as much, if not more. We have a really cool balance between very grounded, um, real drama, and then also this jarring craziness. Needless to say, the actress thinks that Kate's superpowers are pretty cool. Share in the comments if you'd want to have similar abilities. And meanwhile, we'll talk about Maddie's personal life. Some time ago, she was rumored to be dating her Summerland co-star, Rory J. Saper. They definitely have incredible chemistry, but it looks like there's nothing romantic going on between them. Maddie once shared that Rory was a close friend even before they co-starred in Summerland, so she was happy to do a movie with him. And these days, the 29-year-old actress appears to be single. Now let's talk about Chancey Perdomo as Andre. 
The actor loves how the series showcases the human aspects in everyone. And according to Chance, it's cool that Gen V doesn't cast judgment on anyone, even on controversial characters like Andre. He's a charmer, he's a slacker, and he doesn't want any responsibility whatsoever. Yet he can still be a hero. And who is he in real life? In fact, we don't really know as 27-year-old Chance is a pretty secretive person. Get this, he's a rare celebrity who has a private Instagram account. So even if he does post photos with his significant other, a random fan won't be able to see them. We're not sure if the actor is dating anyone. But there's a rumor that he's in a relationship with his chilling adventures of Sabrina co-star, Toddy Gabrielle. Their on-screen chemistry was undeniable, but it appears that they're just friends in real life. Chance even said once that no one knows him better than Tati, but of course, that doesn't mean that there's anything romantic between them. Next on our list is Asa German as Sam. While his co-stars gush over the idea and message of the series, this guy had a much more material thing to adore during filming, his mattress in the woods. This is literally the most comfortable thing I have ever sat on in my entire life. In fact, Asa found it so comfy that he even had a secret plan. I don't know what it is, but I'm gonna try to steal this when we finish filming. Don't tell anybody. I wonder if he succeeded. Anyway, similarly to most of the other stars of the show, 26-year-old Asa is a private person. He doesn't talk much about his personal life and keeps a low-key profile on social media, yet we do know that he's been dating a girl named Marilyn Morris for about five years. Unfortunately, there's no information about how they met or who she is, so let's just wish them all the best and move on to Derek Liu and London Thor as Jordan Lee. This is pretty much the most unusual character in the entire series, and the two actors playing Jordan Lee look so similar that many fans think that they're related in real life. However, it's not true. Derek and London aren't brother and sister or anything. And what's more, they'd never even worked together before Gen V. Yet they quickly managed to create a connection. When we first met, it was kind of like we both had similar thoughts. We both were open to talking about the character and open to each other's opinions. Together, they built Jordan Lee from the ground up. But we're here to talk about their personal lives, right? And that's where they're the most different. 26-year-old London is a married woman. Her husband's name is Carson Daniel Pfeiffer, and he's a musician and producer. Derek, in his turn, is 31 and seems to be single. But the Jordan Lee actors actually have something very important in common. They're both musicians. Derek has created three singles and four albums and even toured alongside Machine Gun Kelly. Meanwhile, London has been writing music since she was 15 years old and released her EP on iTunes. Hopefully the two of them will record something together one day soon. And here's a bonus for you. Jensen Ackles as Soldier Boy. He only had a short cameo in Gen V, but it's pretty much impossible to skip this actor. Don't spoil any secrets. God bless America. His brief appearance was kept a secret till the last moment. And it was worth it as the cameo became an amazing surprise for the boys' fans. Jensen was certainly happy to reprise his role. Even though it meant a bit more time away from his family, the actor has been married to actress Danielle Harris for 14 years, and they have three kids together. Jensen met her on the set of Supernatural, the iconic series that made him a star, and they've been inseparable ever since. Now it's time for you to say what you think about season one of Gen V. Share in the comments below, and then go ahead and watch other videos on ASA.